Hello, my brothers and sisters in Christ and all my little YouTube family. It's growing again. Today is Friday, July the 16th, and it's 1.16 p.m. I was going to do a video on just one prophecy. And then I got to thinking, I wonder where did I get this from? Was it in my email or was it on Grafted In? So anyway, I went to Grafted In Team Jesus on their website. And I found the area where they put just prophecies. And I was scrolling down and I was like, wow, I wanted to share every one of these. So if you like to um, I hope along with reading your Bible, stay in the word. The Lord has put out words saying stay in the, stay in the word. And you just want to watch good YouTube videos uh, that will encourage your soul. Some are encouraging you. Some are firm words now for those who aren't ready. But at least it's something you can share with somebody. Okay? And they, I'm pretty sure they all came from 444 Prophecy News. But they don't like to put that on there because they don't want people to be sent there and then start reading prophecies that are not of the Lord. Okay, so like, for instance... This one, I think I shared a couple already. This one's Be Ready, Now is the Time by Lynn Johnson. This one is The Time is Now, Victoria Ang. I'm pretty sure I put hers up. It is At an End by someone named Polox, P-O-L-L-O-X. That may be pronounced wrong, I'm not sure. Now this one, I really thought, okay, I'm going to put this one up next, but... It's called Detainment Camps, and she had a word received. This is a word received. I am wants you to know that events are going to happen, dot, 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 by Lynn Johnson. All right, so under that, radioactive clouds from war in Asia. That's by Anno Domini. 144k then under that what does that say overcomers shows what i believe is probably the bride of christ 144k climbing a mountain peter kirstein let's see february 12 2021 peter kirstein the Holy Spirit spoke the following about the overcomers to those that follow Jesus on the road of dot dot dot. Okay, so and then there's 144,000. Um, some of these they're dated like March 21st, 21, but they were put up recently. And here's one God warned us. From November of 2016, called, quote, against my design, unquote. <clears throat> I believe I put that one on BitChute by Glenda Lomax. And anyway, I'm just going to move on. As always, use discernment. When you ever read God's word on a, or message, a message, a, see, uh, visions, I suppose the devil could give somebody a, a vision, but I find it highly unlikely, an open-eyed vision. I tend to take those at face value. Uh, and if I don't understand it, I just go, well, I'll understand it later. But dreams... Dreams can often be part from the Lord, and they might continue and be part from the flesh. So you always take those to the Lord. Usually they're, they're um, well, I'm not going to say usually. Sometimes they're always the whole thing from the Lord, especially if they're the shorter kind. All right, this is the glorification of the sons of God by Peter Kirstein, and on and on it goes. First fruits transfiguration. Do you wonder about that? Well, here's you a, let's see if it's a 
um, received a prophecy on 10-7-21. It's a message, okay? So, uh, without remedy, America shall fall. That's, that's by Glenda Lomax. Oh, there's just so many, and the titles make me want to just click on them and watch. Now, I, I'm pretty sure I watched this one, and an announcement came. All businesses closed, and everyone was told to go home. And this was a dream given to Matt M. All right? Message from the Lord, the arch and the arrow. Did y'all know that the arrow uh, can mean um, prick? To prick and the pronunciation of the Greek word is toxon, toxon, toxin, toxin. Get it? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I don't know why I do that. It's almost, it's involuntary. Destruction, destruction, destruction comes to your land. U.S. get ready. Well, I'm not going to read any more of oh, this one. Uh, see, there were so many that was just coming and coming and coming here lately or being reposted. And I was like, oh, Lord, I, I don't have enough time in the day. I want to post all of these. Well, now you can go to this one page and scroll down and, and take your time and just watch them all. Okay, let's see, you just, I want to make sure I tell you this right. I'll go back up to the top and click on one. Ah, yeah, you just click on it and it goes right to it and you can read it right here. And this is a short one. The last one put up, I'll go ahead and read it. Word received February 11, 2021, at 2.34 a.m. My children, it is now, or it is now, be ready for your anointing comes without warning. All things have changed. Nothing will be the same as this age ends. And my kingdom of glory begins. The harvest of souls is here. The time is short to do your mission. Okay, he's talking to the first fruits. Our time is short to do our mission, to harvest souls. All right, wait for your anointing. And then your instructions from me. I might have put this one up. Listen for my voice and follow my guidance. Once again, do not lean on your own understanding. I expect complete obedience from my warriors of faith. Nothing less. This is your time to do exploits. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I did. That reminds me. Because I found the verse that talked about greater things than these shall you do. And put it up on the picture. So I won't read any more. But I'm just going to stop it here and say I plead the blood of Jesus over this video. Over this website. Over my channel. Over each and every one of us and our devices. And all of our internet connections. Okay. And with that I'm going to say. Welcome back to those of you who finally found me. And I'm so glad. Uh, the, the numbers are growing. <laughs> it won't be what it was. Because I know most of those people. like They either quit YouTube. Or just moved on. And I never heard from them again. So numbers can be so deceiving. It doesn't really matter. I just want to fellowship or be talking to the folks I'm used to here this last year or two. You know what I mean? And those of you have encouraged me so much. So with that, I'm going to say bye for now. Have a blessed day.
or night, wherever you are, and I'll talk to you later.